Hey everyone, it's Katie and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the TMI tag. I'm going to be revealing way too much information about myself. I've seen a couple people do this tag recently and I thought, why not? And I just thought it'd be a great video since I'm still a little bit new to YouTube and it'd just be a better way for you to get to know me just a little bit better in the most TMI way, too much information, what the heck am I doing kind of way. So this tag is about 50 questions and this should be a lot of fun. So let's get started. What are you wearing? I'm wearing this shirt that says like something about being beautiful and what beauty is and I really think this is cute and it's a, this is from Marshalls and my shorts have elephants on them and I'm obsessed with elephants and these are from Marshalls as well. And I'm wearing my Alex and Ani bracelets and yeah that's it. That's all I'm wearing. Ever been in love? No. Ever have a terrible breakup? No. How tall are you? I am 5'6". How much do you weigh? Everyone skips this question so yeah. Any tattoos? I'm the kind of person that I change my mind all the time. Something that I like for a tattoo now is not going to be something I like for a tattoo when I'm 80 or 60 or 50. So I'm not really like going to get a tattoo. Any piercings? Yes! I'm not wearing any of my earrings today besides my cartilage. I have three piercings but if you want to call count every single like hole that is in my ear then I would have five piercings. OTP? Ooh, good question. And if you don't know what OTP is, OTP is one true pairing, which is basically two people on a show that you ship together or people who are not on a show and that you like together. Ezra, I like Linstead, Dossie. So favorite TV shows? Um, I like Pretty Little Liars, The Fosters, Grey's Anatomy, Revenge, um, Chicago PD, Chicago Fire, SVU, The Middle, Modern Family, Finding Carter's really good, ooh, last night's episode, oh my god, please talk to me about that in the comment section below, I don't want to spoil anything, but oh my god, things went down, ooh, Chasing Life is good, um, it's coming back in a couple weeks, I'm excited for that, yeah, I love Love TV. Favorite bands? Um, I'm not really a band kind of person. I like a lot of artists and not very many bands. One Direction, of course. Um, I really like Eco Smith right now. Their songs are wicked good. My favorite song right now is Bright. Someone you miss? My best friend. I haven't seen her in weeks and I know when we see each other again we're gonna just have a big SVU marathon. That's just what we do. Favorite song? I don't have a favorite song. Song. In my last tag, I said my favorite song right then was Sparks by Hilary Duff. Still one of my favorite songs. I listen to it every day. Such a good song. I really like Carly Rae Jepsen's new song, I Really Like You or Really Like You, whatever it's called. And Nikki Philippi here on YouTube did a cover of it. Uh, I think it's on Spotify. It's amazing. I think I like it way better than the original. It's so amazing. And how old are you? I am 19 years old almost 20 in a couple months. Yes, I'm excited not to be a teenager anymore. Zodiac sign. I read a lot of stuff about my horoscope. I follow the Virgo Twitter. I am very committed to my Virgo and I love being a Virgo and I have a charm for it. Love being a Virgo. I'm like obsessed with being a Virgo. It's kind of weird. Quality you look for in a partner. I have a couple different things that I want in a relationship or even just a friendship. I think it's good to have this good sense of humor because then you can laugh and everybody loves to laugh let's be honest and somebody who is caring somebody who's friendly and somebody who is who works hard likes to work gotta gotta be ambitious favorite quote okay so i have a lot of favorite quotes but one that i've liked recently is if you can imagine it you can achieve it if you dream it you can become it and i think that's very inspiring it really speaks to me because i just want to achieve all my goals and follow my dreams and just it motivates me to just do more favorite actor Ooh. okay so favorite actor i don't really have one but i really like jesse Lee Soffer for his role on Chicago PD and he's been in like um 
a couple different um, things like movies and stuff that I think he did really oh my god his role was so believable and just how he played those people was amazing and yeah I'm not really in big into actors but I think he did a really good job and everything I think he's a pretty good actor no I think he is a good actor actress would have to be Sophia Bush definitely again from Chicago PD but all the things she's been in she's been really good in and I just love her as a person too. I think she's inspirational for all the work she does from acting to just inspirational work and everything. Favorite color? Purple. If you couldn't already tell, everything I own is purple. Love the color I always have and I always will. Loud or soft music? Depending on my mood but I like listening to very upbeat music at a very loud level. So if that's what you mean, then that's what I mean. Where do you go when you're sad? My bed. Then I go on Netflix. Don't we all? I think so. How long do you take in the sh How long do you take in the shower? If I'm washing my hair, I can take anywhere from 10 to 20 minutes in the shower. But if I'm just washing my body, I can take 5 to 10 minutes in the shower and everything. It just really depends how tired I am and what kind of day I'm having. How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? Anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour depending like how much time I have. If I have to be out the door in 10 to 15 minutes, I can get ready and make myself look presentable in that 10 to 15 minutes. But if I have an hour, I'm going to use that hour and just take my time. Ever been in a physical fight? Yes. You haven't even seen the other person. Just kidding. I have not been in a physical fight. I don't even think I can handle a physical fight. <laughs> Turn on. So like capabilities would be definitely somebody who's funny and kind. But if we're talking about physical features, definitely somebody who has a great smile and stuff. I don't know. I feel like teeth is the first thing that I notice about somebody. I feel like people who smile are more fun to be around because you want to be around somebody who's happy. Happy. So turn off. Definitely people who are just not fun to be around, like people who are negative. The reason I joined YouTube. I joined YouTube because I've been watching YouTube videos for years now, ever since YouTube was pretty much created, when it was just like cat videos and just regular weird videos. And a couple of years ago, I would just watch these girls on YouTube, um, just like, and I really love like like the idea of it and that's where I got all the makeup tips and what clothes to wear, what makeup to buy and I just really loved it and I ended up watching beauty videos for a couple of years and then I got more interested in makeup and I just loved it and then I would always make little videos for myself when I was younger and we'd always be making videos. My brother and I would always make funny videos and everything and, and I was really wanting to make YouTube videos for probably a couple of years now and a month ago I decided to post a video and it was a what's in my purse video. It was kind of awkward and it was weird and then that's how I ended up here on YouTube. <laughs> it's a weird story but it's kind of funny how this all came out. YouTube. I am terrified of birds. Like if I see a bird swerving or just swooping down, I will be that person that will scream and like duck. I try to avoid going anywhere near birds. I can't stand birds. Like that's how afraid I am. It's like a legitimate phobia. Like I'm pretty sure if I saw one, I would run. I, uh, Seagulls are the birds that freak me out the most because they're such scavengers. They try to get your food and bird fear, way above that fear. Last thing that made you cry. I was watching Finding Carter this morning, the episode from last night, and I'm pretty sure I started crying when somebody died. I'm not going to say who because I don't want to put spoilers out there, but oh my god. If you want to have a conversation with me about that, Definitely leave a comment down below saying you watch Finding Carter and we can chat about that because it was like what is life, what just happened, and oh my god. So yeah, I think that's the last time I cried. Last time you said you loved somebody. It was definitely last night to my mom when I was saying goodnight. Meaning behind your YouTube name, my name is Katie. XO, I just 
like the way that sounded and beauty because I wanted people to know what my channel was about. Katie XO Beauty put it all together and I felt like it fit and I really liked that name. It would have to be this book for school called The Other West More. I read that my first semester at college. It's a pretty, it's a really good book. Um, it's definitely a book you will judge by the cover because it sounds weird and everything, but it's a really good book and it's a true story. The book you're currently reading. I'm currently reading Extraordinary Means by Robin Schneider. So far, so good. You should definitely check it out. It just came out a couple weeks ago. And I love this book. It's amazing. Best show you watched. Finding Carter this morning because I missed it last night. You should definitely go check it out. It's such a good show. You will love it. It's so crazy and so much. It will blow your mind. Go watch it. Last person you talked to. My mom this morning and I'm pretty sure I was half asleep when I was talking to her. The relationship between the last person you texted. Last person I texted was my best friend Allie and she is my best friend. I think I already said that but there you go. Favorite food. It really depends what kind of mood I'm in. I love pasta. Chicken parmesan is my favorite but I also love pizza um, and cake. Who doesn't love cake? Place you want to visit. I would love love to go out of the country. Just so many places I'd love to go to. I have not been to the west coast side of things so California is top on my list. Want to go there so bad. But definitely out of the country. Um, heard Australia is cool. Um, anywhere in Europe. It just really really cool to go there. And definitely Italy because Italian here. Last place you were, either my bed or my bathroom to fix my hair. Do you have a crush? Not at the moment. Last time you were insulted. Probably a second ago because you never know. Flavor or sweet? Um, love cake like I said before. Ice cream is my fave too. I love double chocolate cake, triple chocolate cake, cake, chocolate. Yes, my favorite. What instruments do you play? Yeah, I'm a no talent instrument kind of person. I played the pre-order in third grade, but other than that, I have no talent in the music department. Favorite piece of jewelry? My Alex and Ani bracelets are my favorite. They're easy to put on. They are customizable because you can just pick from so many. They have so many like designs. They are amazing and they look so cute together. Last sport you played? On a team? Soccer. And that was when I was like an elementary elementary school song you just sang. The song by Carly Rae Jepsen, I Really Like You, or whatever that song is called, I sang the version that Nikki Philippi did, oh my god. I like it better than the original. It's so good. Oh my favorite chat up line. Did it hurt when he fell from heaven? Have you ever used it? No. Heck no. Why? Last time you hung out with somebody. Last night, my brother, my mom, and my dogs and I were all watching weird TV shows on TV. I don't even know what they were watching, but we all sat on the couch together last night. Who should answer these questions next? You should! This is a really fun tag. You should definitely do these questions. And if you end up doing this tag, please leave your, just leave your video in the comment section below. And I would definitely love to watch it. I think these videos are very fun to watch. I think they're very interesting. Thanks for watching my TMI tag. I hope this isn't too weird. I just thought this was really fun. Actually, this was pretty fun. So I hope you enjoyed it. Definitely like this video if you liked my TMI tag. Leave me a comment down below of what kind of videos I should do next and comment down some answers to these questions down below. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and comment. I'll see you in my next video. Bye!